With the new academic year starting, here's a few ideas for you for using Google Classroom. On Google Classroom, you can click the plus button to create a new class, or if you've already got one, just click on it to open it. Now, when you want to enroll the students, go to the Students tab, and you have a code up there on the left-hand side. If you click that code, there's a new feature called Display. If you press that, the code will come up nice and big for you, and your students will be able to see it on the main board. Uh, if you want to invite the students instead, you can click the Invite Students button and enter their names. Now, when the students first use Google Classroom, it's a good idea to have an activity for them to do. So let's go through making one very quickly uh, that uh, will be interesting for them. So if I click on my untitled document here, it's just a Google document I've created, and I'm going to click here and we'll call it Induction, and then we'll do some activity. So one might be add a picture of your favourite animal. And two, perhaps we put a picture in and we want the students to label it. So here we can go to insert an image. And I've already done a little search. And this search was for horse diagram. And I found here there's one and it's got letters on it. So you can select and label it. So if I click select there. So we'll add, please add the description to the label below and perhaps we'll write in A, maybe B, C, D and then the students will be able to enter their labels there and do the activity. So with this one here, the add a picture of your favourite animal, uh, it's a nice way of actually introducing the students to the Google uh, system and you can actually insert images from here and therefore they don't need to go off the screen. So we'll add in the instruction, add a picture of your favourite animal without leaving this tab on the browser because that's a little bit of a challenge for them. Okay, And then you could add several other questions and then just close your document down and now on Google Classroom let's click the plus button and we'll create an assignment and perhaps we'll call it induction task and then click on your Google Drive it knows our recent documents, I'll double click on there to open it and what we must do here, instead of students can view file we want the students to complete the document and therefore we want to make a copy for each student so we'll do that, press the assign button and now the students have all got an assignment, which you can all work through together. You can look at, sort of share all the favourite animals and things, and it'll be an activity for the students to do.